This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. If you've been following along with this lesson, then you may have three things. You may have an event that's called Live Shots. You would have had to have done this one yourself through your webcam, but you might have that. We have Zoo Stills, which comes from our work folder. And we have Zoo Video, which again is the video that's in the work folder. We've made a decision here. We're getting too complicated. What do we need all these events for? Why don't we put everything into one, which makes perfect sense. How do we do that? Well, if you're only moving one into another, all you have to do is grab it and drag it on top and let go. But we're a little bit more, not much, but we're a little bit more complicated. We have three. So I'm going to select Zoo Video. I'm going to hold down the Apple key, Zoo Stills, and I'm going to select Live Shots. The Apple allows you to do non-contiguous selection. Now go up to the word File on the pull-down menu and go down to Merge Events. Nice little dialog box here, Merge Selected Events and Move All Media. Here's one thing to remember, it's very important. When you change things in the event library, you are physically changing files on your hard drive. If you say delete, it deletes. If you move, it moves. Now we can give it a new name. Let's call this the Zoo Project. We will save it on the same hard drive. Makes sense, I suppose. Let's go ahead and click OK. Yes, right there. Now it's processing it. It's moving them. And look what it did. It created a brand new folder called the Zoo Project. And that has all the stuff in it, all our stuff. We always got to have stuff. And it got rid of the other events. If you've got too many events relating to one specific project, makes sense to merge them together. But remember, you are actually moving the files.